Occupational therapists work with parents, teachers and support staff to help students to develop the skills to successfully participate at school. Today I'm here to teach you about heavy work and to demonstrate some heavy work activities in the classroom environment. Heavy work can help your students to improve their focus and attention, self-regulation skills and to get their bodies to ready to learn new information. Now let's talk the science. Heavy work is deep proprioceptive pressure to the muscles and joints. When doing the tasks that require resistance against the muscles, this sends messages to the brain to release neurotransmitters called serotonin and dopamine. These neurotransmitters help the body to get in the just right zone for learning. The just right zone is when a student's body is in the optimal level for alertness, for focusing and learning. Heavy work works in two ways. If a student is feeling hyperactive or on the go, heavy work will work with them to calm their bodies to the just right zone for learning. Now, if a student's body is underactive, tired or feeling slow, heavy work provides movement and will help wake their bodies up to the just right zone for learning. Having worked in schools, I know teachers are really busy, so my role as an OT is to identify ways to easily incorporate heavy work into everyday classroom routine without taking up your valuable time or space. If one of your students is having difficulty focusing, they may appear hyperactive or even lethargic. To get them in the just right zone for learning, here are seven easy heavy work activities that you can try today. Wall pushes. Ask your student to push against a wall or even against another student's hand for five to 10 seconds at a time. When completing a wall push, make sure your students keep their bodies held strong and have a slight bend in their elbows. This creates extra resistance against the muscles and sends messages to the brain to release the important neurotransmitters to get the body in the just right zone for learning. Chair push-ups. A simple and subtle heavy work activity can be done in the comfort of a student's chair. Instruct your students to place their hands on their feet and raise their legs and bottom off the seat five to 10 times. Handing out workbooks. In primary schools, students are often asked to give them the task to hand out workbooks to their classmate. If a student requires a movement break, this is a great opportunity for a heavy work activity as the child must carry and distribute a heavy load of workbooks that places resistance against their arm muscles. Stacking or unstacking chairs. This is a great whole classroom or individual approach to providing calming heavy work. Other ideas include pushing an iPad or laptop trolley, moving desks or helping the sports teacher to move or set up their sporting equipment desk cleaning. Whenever a student may require a movement break or some calming sensory input, ask the student to clean their desk or whiteboard with extra effort or muscle power. The delivery. Here is an easy and simple strategy that can also be used as a daily classroom job. Place a note in a heavy workbook and ask your student to deliver it to the school's office. Door frame push. Ask your student to push their arms and legs out to spread and fill the door frame and then push for five seconds at a time. So in closing, if you want to keep your students in the just right zone for learning, simply trial a couple of these heavy work activities each day and see which ones work for your class.